Boydy Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's Manga Nerdigan Live reaction video is going to be for Oshinoko chapters 53 through 54. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe button. And if you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this operation a-going, um, please feel free to hit up my PayPal and Cash App. Those links are in the description box below. So last chapter, Akane took her role of being a part-time girlfriend to the next level because she's willing to kill for Aqua because, you know, Aqua told her what he wants to do. Woman, you are nuts. You are nuts because he don't feel that way about you. You feel a certain way about him. Nah, he ain't interested. <laughs> he ain't interested like that. But you're lucky he's still going to help you because what she wants to do, obviously, is metaphorically kill a couple of actors careers and we'll see we'll see if she can do that but that means aqua has to let go bring down his walls and get into the extreme emotional passionate acting and it could be very therapeutic for him because remember he still hasn't come to terms with the eyes grief anyway let's get to um chapter 53 first see what's in store for us today and this chapter is titled pick up do you enjoy going around with that look on your face? I will leave you. This sucks. Narashima Melt reflects on his uh, poor performance in the drama suite today and his efforts to improve since then. Hmm. It's fine. It's fine. So, uh, it's so not. I'm Aqua's sister. It's my job to make sure he's doing all right. I can totally see him um, ending up all alone again. This is also a chance to see a real life set. I can tour it and look out for my brother at the same time. It's a win-win. Woman, you just want to be on that set. My agency is super strict if they find out I'm in for a beating and a half. Hey, hmm. You're that guy from Sweet Today, the one <laughs> who can't act. <laughs> Oh, the shade going on in her head. You know who I am? Yes. My name is Hoshino Ruby. Thanks um, for looking out for my brother. Oh, I see. Um, you're Aqua's sister. Indeed, indeed. Um, if you're looking for him, he already left. What? Rehearsals are over for today. I'm just trying to get, um, get some extra practice in. Oh, I see. He's been coming home at a different time every day. I thought for sure... So what's he been up to so late at night? Hmm. Well, he's been going home with Kurokawa. Kurokawa? I'm calling him about this. Ruby, don't be tactless. Let it be. Don't fuck around with this. If you do, you're going to push him away and you don't want that. Tackless, he's been leaving here with a beautiful girl. He's not coming home till late. There's one possibility, right? I don't get it. What are you trying to say? Um, uh, they're probably... <laughs> they're probably doing lewd things. Lewd things! No way. That's why it's better to leave it be. But he's doing it every day. Oh my god. He's not doing it every day. He's not doing it. He hasn't come home um, on time once these past few days. He's more vir um, vigorous than he seems. I guess appearances are deceiving. There's um, there's no stopping a high school kid with a smug and hot girlfriend. Oh, no, no, no. Um, he wouldn't do that. I, can, I just can't see my brother running the risk of pregnancy with a high school girl. If he did, I would lose all respect for him. All oh, this background. This background has given me everything. And look at that blank look in Ruby's eyes. Oh, she ain't fucking around. She means it. She would lose all that respect. Ruby, don't worry. I trust my brother. Even all this um secretive, even all the secretiveness is just a part of who he is. I'm sorry. Could I maybe use the bathroom? Uh, me too. I guess it's awkward talking about your brother doing that sort of thing. Hey, are you waiting for someone? Mm -hmm. Oh, no, I'm actually... So, you're an actress? I believe it. You're cute enough. Oh, gosh. Um, what agency are you with? Cannon Fire. Oh, that's funny. I have a few friends who work there. Um, you know, Nolan or, um, you know, uh, Kureha? Yeah, they're my co-workers. 
Um, we should all meet up sometime. Here's my line. Uh, mm, uh, um... Kamoshida-san, the director's calling us. There's an emergency. There's an emergency meeting. What? Really? Wait a minute. Um, Kaneda-san's real, real scary when he gets mad. Hurry up. Catch you later. Ooh. She still got it. What's going on? I thought rehearsals ended. I was lying. Hmm. She's a friend of Aqua's sister. I think you'd best lay off. So what? That's your reason for getting in my way? Yes. I'm no saint either. I don't have any problem with you picking up girls, but don't you think it's better to think twice before doing something that might affect our work? You're just acting scared. How would it affect us? Oh, oh boy. Don't you see? We're supposed to be professionals. Professionals coming from a no-talent wannabe like you? That's pretty funny. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> oh, bounce! Melt! Oh God, you just became a tuna melt right there. Ooh, ooh, he put you in that panini machine. But dude, these backgrounds are just giving me life. I live. Oh my God, you're just living the easy life being a model. Sometimes you get a TV role. Sometimes you use your connections and get a stage role. I really hope you realize you're the worst actor here. You're dragging the whole play down. Ooh, you too. <laughs> Tell them how you really feel. You're dragging it for Phil. Say what you will about me. I'm here because I can act. And yet, what can you do? Is there anything worse than some hypocrite trying to lecture people? If it were coming from um, Himikawa, I might have taken it seriously, but not from the likes of you. Huh, jeez, her tits were so big, man. Damn it. Ooh, that was low, man. I really hope you realize you're the worst actor here. You're dragging down the whole play. Dude, these backgrounds are just everything. <sighs> of course I know. Of course I do. Poor Mel. Like, I want to, I, I can't believe I say, I'm saying I want to protect him, but God damn it, Mel. I, I do. Ever since I acted with him, it's never left my mind. Now we're back at Strawberry Productions um, Limited. Here we go. One of my brother's friends gave me his line. He said we should all go uh, get something to eat sometime. Uh, what? Is there a problem? Now, I respect them as actors and as people. There are a lot of great people in the acting business. With that said, these 2.5D actors who come out and straight up ask for your uh, number are bad news. He's probably, he's probably a man or <laughs> You're not wrong. Even if they message you, don't go meet them. Um, give me your phone so I can block them. What? What? Ugh, before Aqua even knows. All right, let's get to chapter 54. But dude, I love this manga. I do. The two circling around Aqua are, and this chapter is titled Point of Contention. Ooh, we got a yin-yang motif going on with these backgrounds. Ooh, she mad. She mad. What are you glaring at? Ooh, Kirka, why are you mad? I'm not glaring, actually. Liar. Liar, you uh, you always look like you're on the verge of falling asleep, except when you're staring daggers at me. <laughs> I look at everyone like this, actually. Maybe you're just convinced um, you're a special little snowflake. Who do you think I am? Don't you know I'm a prod... Um, wait, don't you know I'm a prodigy? Oh, fucking A. Why am I reading this wrong? Who do you think I am? Don't you know I'm a prodigy, right? Oh, God. Dude, what is, everyone is being dragged right now. Oh, God, they are being dragged. Melk, let's be real, Melt was dragged through the mud. We ain't getting a drag through the mud situation here yet. Mm -mm. It's disgusting how you clean your past glory. Are you even working on improving your current self? Oh, goodness me. Where did you learn to talk like that? You sure do hate me. You hate me so much you can't help but say things like that. Isn't that right, Kurokawa Kanishan? Ooh, she pulled the book. Book of Age Theater, theater Child Actor Special Edition. Ah! <laughs> That's, what's, um, what's that book? I just happened to overhear that a certain renowned actress, the genius named Kawa Akane, was inspired to start a career by a certain actress. Oh, no! Oh! Stop, 
Why do you have that? Well, I'm just curious who would, um, uh, who would such an amazing person idolize? I heard there's an interview with Kurokawa-san from when she um, did her first stage role. I ordered a back issue of this magazine to check it out. So let's see. What? What? The person you looked up to was me. You started acting because you wanted to be like me. Oh my God. Ah, Kara is dragging this bitch. Kurokawa, you tried. You tried to be smart with the Rima. You tried. Oh, you tried. But boy, did this backfire on you. Oh, you tried to. You are getting served. You are getting served a delicious Carmapolitan right now. <laughs> Get her, Rima. No way. If you really like me, you should have said so from the start. Sorry, but I don't like you at all. Um, it's going to be an unrequited love story. Uh, uh, oh my god, let me read this again. Sorry, but... Oh god, I gotta read this right here. Oh my god! I can't take this! Ah! No way! If you really like me, you should have said so from the start. Sorry, but I don't like you at all. It's going to be an unrequited love. Sorry, you're merciless! Damn straight she is! Woo! You thought what happened to Melt was being... He was... You thought that melt was being dragged through the mud. Woo! Rima! Bitch! Dude. Dude, you are... Oh my god, you dragging her to the mud pit. Next thing you know, there's gonna be some mud wrestling going on. <laughs> Tried. You, you know what, Kurokawa, you get an A for effort, but ooh, ooh this bitch. She, okay, let me word it this way. Kurokawa was trying to drag Ariba, but it was only in a mud pedal that she that that's how far she got. But ooh, no, no, nah, nah. Ariba wasn't playing. She dragged her. She dragged her deep into the mud. Oh god, I don't think there's anything left. There's nothing. I don't think there's anything left. Oh god, at this point. Who? Who? Who told her? It's gotta be someone from La La Lee. Sorry. Um. Sorry, Hibikawa. Um. Uh, you guys are always at each other's throats. I knew you were rivals, but I didn't expect it to be this complicated, though. It's not like that at all. Dude, you are underestimating, like, us women. <laughs> us women, when there's a grudge, when there's a grudge, we drag each other. We, yeah, and when there's bad blood, there's bad blood. Oh, God. With men, at least you men are straightforward. We women, we women are not. We women are catty bitches. <laughs> we are! This just proved it. I admired her. Anyone, uh, anyone would, um, seeing someone their age on TV, seeing them be so popular. I joined a children's acting troupe so, just so I could be, um, I joined a children's, uh, God, I can't get over this shit. I'm sorry. Damn it, Arima. Oh, I joined a children's acting troupe just so I could become like her. But just look at her. She's so full of herself and always harassing me. Bitch, you started this. Kurokawa, you started this shit. You tried to drag Arima in the mud, and you only got into a shallow ass puddle. And instead, she served her as a karma colada. Well, a karma politan. A giant glass of karma politan, and you couldn't take it. You couldn't take what she was serving. Bitch, you are full of yourself, too. The projection... Dude, this is like a pot calling the um, kettle black. It is. Shut the fuck up. Shut up, bitch. Shut up. Dude, you're saying said that Arima harassing you, but bitch, you were glaring daggers at her. What did you expect her to do? Trying to show off by starting idle activities on the side and acting like a hotshot YouTuber. Excuse me, Stub. A fan stuck into the venue and they're scaring me. Save me. <laughs> oh, Rima, I love you. Fan? I'm an actress. Stub! <laughs> you fucking bitch! Dude, she just keeps on dragging you, girl. You are not going to win this. 
Oh god, Krokawa just back the fuck down. You ain't winning this. Um, it's a- See, even Aqua's saying this. It's a waste of time to trying to beat her at her own game. You're too earnest to win this. <laughs> Thank you, Aqua. At least I won't be remembered for singing about, um, about- Oh my god. At least I won't be remembered for singing about Peppers. Oh, sick burn. Hold up, Akane. Um, hold up, Akane, says the reality star. Talk about outside activities. What? <laughs> this gunfight is everything. What encounter? Arena's got a strong comeback. Excuse me, I'll take this one. Okay, I got this side covered. Bitch, you started this! I hope Aqua tells you you started this. Um, she pisses me off. What's wrong with her? Well, she's... <laughs> well, she's always been rude. Um, it's not her manners, but her whole personality, and she used to be even worse. Well, I also worked with her back then. Then take my side, her personality sucks. Well, you see... Actually, I think I also wanted to strangle her back then. <laughs> you did, right? Back when I did... Ah, oh, that felt good. Ah, oh, that felt good! Did you see her face, Krakow? That guy was so pissed! You really messed up, dude! I do not believe her! Woman is jelly! She jellier than a Smucker's factory! Oh my god! That's a- Dude, she is! Bitch, you- You are fucking around with her mans. Even though he's not her mans yet. But bitch, you fucking around with her mans. Then he's glaring daggers at her. Like, what the fuck do you want from her? Oh my god. This, yeah, this is gonna get straight up show- Dude, this will end up- um, Watch, this is gonna be straight up showgirls. Where someone gonna be throwing some diamonds or some marbles or something down the stairs. <laughs> watch! If I knew you'd be like this, I wouldn't have told you. Why do you fight with Carl Kava so much? Even if it's just temporary, she's dating Aqua from your agency. You should get along. It's just for business, right? <laughs> well, I have many reasons. It's just the nature of people from the same generation. It... This is just how women are. Just, it's just you, you men don't get it. No. And you can say that I'm sexist all you want. You men just don't get it. We women are bitchy and catty and petty as fuck. It's not like this is my first time acting with her. We fought every time before. It stems from our different methods of acting, both our approaches to our appro both our approach to our roles and what we consider good acting. Her acting screams out, "I'm right, you're wrong." You can feel that pressure. Oh God, it's that binary mentality. Ugh. God. It's really annoying. Even if I was a genius child actress after puberty, I was always seen as average. I didn't get any work at all. They called Akani a genius even more so now. Um, they called Akani a genius even more so now. If this keeps up, she'll be the one who was right all along. So it's like fate? Well, yeah, although that's a cheap way to put it, but don't worry. I never once thought my acting was inferior to hers. Himikawa, from your point of view, between Arima and Kurokawa, who do you think is better? Hmm. Both of them are veterans, having acted since they were young. They're both good, and I wouldn't go as far as to compare them. But if you had to pick, Kurokawa has an exceptional ability, acting ability such that she is called a genius. Arima, on the other hand, she has a strong attachment to acting itself. Ooh, this page! This panel with, with uh, Arima putting that sword to her neck. Oh, yes. It wouldn't be strange for either of them to win, but it depends on how the play turns out. And this time, it's Arima's win, because I'm here. Himakawa, ooh, I see what Himakawa's saying. It's because Himakawa is going to bring out that passion. Because I see where we're going with this. I see, because Akane has a lot in common with Aqua, because they both wanted to strangle Ariva. besides that, is that they're both considered geniuses, but they don't have that same passion, that fight, that drive that Arima has. But Himikawa does, and same with Arima. So I see what's going on here.
Himikawa is really something else. They really messed up the uh, messed up the casting. Your shittiness is gonna stand out. Arima, would you come rehearse with me after this? Of course, I was about to ask you myself. Aqua, come. We don't have much time. Let's hurry to the director's place. Yeah, let's. I'll never lose. And so the days passed. The day of the opening performance arrived. Dude, I'm. <laughs> Where will these conflicts lead? Oh my god. Next chapter, um, while the original um, authors are watching. Oh my god, it's going to be amazing. But, bitch! Bitch! The way that freaking Arima dragged Hirakawa. Like, you can tell. It, it was leading up to this, too, with what Himakawa said. About, um, about the difference between their acting. Where... It really showed up in their cat fight. It did. Because you saw that, you know, that you had, um, you had Akane be like, I'm right, you're wrong, blah, 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 blah. She had that mentality going on. But bitch, Rima came and served. She did. She was passionate. She was ready. She was merciless. And that's the thing with acting, with, with the industry. You have to be cutthroat. Connie ain't cut throat like like Arima. If she was cut throat, she would have got she would have served Arima. She would have destroyed her. But nope. Nope, she didn't. She did not serve. And it was a sl dude, it was a slaughter. The situation with Mel, that wasn't a slaughter. Yeah, he got dragged in the mud. But oh, he was not slaughtered like like Akane was this day. Oh my god. God, dude, this has to be, like, one of my favorite chapters of for Arima. Holy shit, that bitch was fucking amazing. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is, like, the best fucking cat fight ever. Oh, my God. I'm really curious what you guys thought of these chapters. And the other thing, and I'm glad I did a double live reaction for this, because you get to see this contrast where you get to see how men dig at each other versus how women dig at each other and i love i love that so i'm i'm really glad i covered it um i'm really glad i did a double live reaction this way let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and remember to like comment share and subscribe to nerdy and if you love what i'm doing i want to help keep this channel alive so i can keep bringing you more oshinoko content um there's a few ways you can do that you can donate to my cash app paypal patreon purchase something on my amazon wish list all it's in the description box below also make sure you follow me on twitter twitch discord friend me on playstation network that's in the description box below as well Till next time nerdigans i will be seeing you later